agricultural news from agview.net. The Creighton University Rural Main Street Index increased slightly in August from July's weak index number. A monthly survey of bank CEOs in rural areas of a 10 state region that depend on agriculture and energy show that the August index is the sixth straight month of a number below growth neutral. The August index showed up a slight increase at 44.7 uh, from July's 44.1, but that number still is a recessionary economic zone. The index ranges from 0 to 100. The index of 50 represents growth neutral. Dr. Ernie Goss oversees the rural Main Street Index at Creighton, says despite the input of some $32 billion in U.S. farm support payments this year, only 8% of the bankers reported their area economy has improved compared to July when 18% said the economic conditions had gotten worse. Well, House Ag Committee Chair Colin Peterson has sent a letter to Ag Secretary Sonny Perdue on the Coronavirus Food Assistance Program, or CFAP. He's asking for clarification on how USDA determined the eligibility of different crops, livestock, and poultry species under CFAP. In that letter, Peterson contends that the data used to USDA to calculate those payments was limited to only the earliest parts of the pandemic, and so it missed the full extent of damages to specific commodities. More on these and other ag news at agview.net. Stay with us.